Hello everybody, welcome to the Pokemon Soul Silver Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. Uh, I haven't booted up the game because uh, I didn't want to do that yet because... That is instant. <laughs> anyway, this is a DS game. Oh, and I skipped it. I skipped the opening. Uh, I'm gonna reset that real quick. Uh, reset. Where's the reset? I'm gonna reset the game. Uh, okay, number one, that game is... Also, this game is loud as shit, so I'm gonna turn that... I'm gonna turn my computer volume down a bit. There you go. There. There. There we go. Let's just watch this opening. So that's the sun? Question mark? Moon? Question mark? Anyway, we see Lugia. So we see Ethan. And Lyra. And we see the places that we can go to, which I don't know the name. I don't know half the names of. And then we see Silver. The legendary beasts. This guy. Unknowns. And then Team Rocket. Whoever they whoever these people are. And then you see your characters with Chikorita. Cyndaquil. Toto Dial. Suicune stares off into the ocean where Lugia is. There you go. Pokemon Soul Silver. There you go. So I've wasted a one and a half minutes doing nothing. Cool. -da -da -da. There you go. So anyway, we're gonna get the briefing here. I'll tell you important stuff. No, I don't. I don't need that stuff. I'm not about that life. Uh, hmm, interesting. Oh, excuse me, sorry, I was just reading this book here. Try to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Oak, but I haven't conquered the Pokemon Professor. Before we go any further, I'd like to tell you a few things you should know about this world. As uh, probably a habit of a Pokemon. They didn't change the Meryl. Oh no. Uh, I feel like that's regular. I don't know. Okay. I'm a dude bro, so of course I am. Uh, anyway, this time I uh, can have my name be a uh, lowercase Reaper, because uh, things aren't stupid. And plus, I'm clicking the letters, I'm not actually pushing any buttons, so... Yay. Yes, my name is Reaper. Duh. Are you ready? Your very own tailor, Grand Adventure, is about to unfold. Blah blah blah. I'll see you later. Yeah, you'll literally see me later. Okay. Okay, so we got a Wii in my room, but, you know, I don't care. Check my mailbox. Lyra? Who gives a shit? <laughs> Honestly, at this point, who gives a fuck? Alright, so as you can see, what's different than this in Star Wars Episode 3 is, um, I switched my screens. So there you go. Playing hide and seek with my Meryl. Uh, I don't care. Train your cards, save my progress, options. Okay, hold on. No, mom. Mommy. Mommy, mom. Okay, there we go. Uh, fast tech speed. And we are on a different frame. Oh, I like that one. Which one looks like the stripes? This one looks like the stripes. There you go. And also I have an extra row because I have a death counter now. Which might help people a little bit. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna hit the save, which is gonna save a lot of data. I know it, it's saving a lot of data, but guess what? I don't give a shit. <laughs> okay, so we're in New Bark Town. Uh, yeah, finally we're playing a generation besides Gen 1 or 3. But uh, wow, that takes too much time to save. Okay. Yeah, I have to play this game two-handed. Alright, so Lyra is gonna bother me about stuff. Boop. Beep, beep. Oh, hi, Lyra. I know you're right there. You're sitting right there. Meryl! Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay, good for you. Uh, so we're just gonna stop on by uh, Professor Elm's lab. Screw you, Silver. And we're just gonna walk over here and talk to this dude, bro. Hi, Reaper. I've been waiting for you. Do you know anything about my history, sir? I uh, you know about a cure to Pokeballs these days. But before the Pokeball was invented, people used to buy from Pokemon, just like your friend Lyra does. Pokeballs are great because they're great for Pokemon, but walking before them has some advantages. It has something to do with how Pokemon grow or evolve, so I'm going to give you a Pokemon. Can you walk beside this Pokemon, outside of this Pokeball, to see if this brings any special feelings to Pokemon? Pokemon? Okay, so we get to see our starter, which... Oh, never mind. Hi, I need email. Uh-huh, okay. Listen, there's a question that called Mr. Pokemon. I don't find which name is driving your brother's discoveries. Uh, I just got an email from Mr. Pokemon. He's probably out of Pokemon anyway. We're so busy with our Pokemon research. I don't know. Hey, yo, I don't know. 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 I don't know
All right, so we get to see our starters. Uh, are they randomized? Mantike, the dragon type. Blastoise, the flying type. Or is Feel the ghost type? They're all initially water or ice types, but whatever. So uh, we're gonna hop over to my random number generator to see what we get. Uh, one will be Mantike, two will be Blastoise, and three will be Feel. So let's see. But oh no, the cries are different. That sounds like... kinda like Chinjo. That sounds like Larvitar, kinda. And that sounds like... uh, Flat Mary? I don't know, let's see what we get. We get starter number two, the Blastoise! If it's actually Blastoise, I'll be really happy. So there we go. Bloop! There we go. I received Blastoise! Wow, I actually did receive Blastoise. Yeah, I'll nickname the Blastoise. There we go. So we get a Blastoise at the start of the game, which is freaking, freaking beautiful. All right, so once I give it a nickname, all right, generate a name. We get Bjorn. <laughs> uh, obviously, I'm going to get rid of the accent, but whatever. So whatever. Hang on, I can be formal with my names. Bjorn. There we go. Bjorn. The Blastoise. Makes a lot of sense. How are you walking? We're probably... Hey, hey, hey. You guys hurt. You sure lose it. It's so easy to use. It's on my desk. Mr. Walking Back is everywhere. I swear it is. I swear to my girls are crazy. Call me that shaker. I can't even remember. Thank you, thank you, Professor Elm. All right, what are your moves looking like? What are you looking like, Blastoise? Pure flying type uh, Blastoise. So we've got Tornadus over here with Psybeam, Bone Rush, Iron <laughs> Earth Power. I with Super Luck. Okay. All right. Uh, we've got a speed raising. Um, what nature are you? You are. Hasty nature. Uh, it's not absolutely horrendous, but I'd prefer with not downing physical defense. Uh, but I guess it doesn't hamper with his special attack. Okay, do you have an item? He does not have an item. So, whatever. Uh, okay. Interesting. Okay, so we're just gonna hit the save button real quick. This is gonna take a really long time, but whatever. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Uh, yeah, I don't think we're gonna get any more encounters because uh, gold and silver slash heart gold soul silver take a really long time to get more encounters. But whatever, I get to use the Blastoise again as my starter, man. Friggin' what is with me and the Squirtle family? I had him during Indigo, but the oh, are you gonna give me Pokeballs now? Okay, potions. Thank you. I didn't want the Nuzlocke rules to start immediately. Don't hesitate to use a potion if you think yours is in danger. My what? Okay, so is, uh, are they gonna blab on a bit? Oh, that means, um, Silver gets feel. No. I don't... I don't, I don't know. Wait, oh, they had the original cry, so I think I chose Blastoise, which had... I remember just feel having Cyndaquil's cry. The beep one was... So I must have had chose Totodile, which means Totodile, which means he would have chosen Mantike. Either he'll have either Mantike or Feel. So you picked a Blastoise. That's a cute Pokemon you have. <laughs> Lyra thinks everything is cute. You should we turn around and talk to it sometimes too. Oh, that's right. Run and show to your mom. See ya. <laughs> Just imagine your mother's reaction. You're like, hey mom, how's it going? And then you walk in, and there's a fucking giant bipedal tortoise behind you. She's like... Oh, Reaper, that's an- Oh my god, what is that thing? Kill him with fire! Why did Professor Elm give you that thing? That sounds a little difficult, but whatever. Oh, I got the puggy gear. Yay, I got a cell phone. Cool. <laughs> Yes, I know how to use it. I know. I'm going to use it for the map feature. Okay. I'm going to use it for the map. Actually, you know what? Unlike Gen 1, you can actually see where you are. New Bark Town. Um, okay. So I broke. <laughs> I broke right there. Uh, we're not even going to bother talking to Silver. So now can we finally leave? Or not. Wait one second. I was going to say, I'll give you my number. Oh, you're supposed to get his number. All right, whatever. I don't know if anything comes up. Okay, um, so I'm a glitchy pile of fuck right now, but who gives a shit? <laughs> also, the ground is tearing, but eh, we're, I'm fine with that. Hey, it's not affecting the frame rate. Uh, okay. It didn't tell me anything changed. Route 29, rest of, west of Cherry Grove City. Okay, so what can we get in this area? What can we get? Let's see what we can get. 
There's also no speeding up in the series, which is good. <laughs> I mean, if it evolves in something good. So, here's the lowdown. Okay, I have randomized Pokemon, types, um, uh, evolutions, stats, everything. Everything is randomized. So, we gotta see what we're working with here. So, I can hit this thing. And it's neutral effective. Poison Tail. Uh, Alright, well, that's neutral on me. Uh... Let's hit you with a Bone Rush. And you're Electric type. You're 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 super effective against it. So all right. So we've got whatever that Bidoof is. Also, want to catch something? It'll show me the. Should that fix it? No, everything's pitch black. Okay, this game is really glitchy. Uh, what happened? Uh, hold on. Are there graphic settings? Uh, huh. This is... This is going to shit. Uh... Hold on, um... Okay, 3D rendering engines. Okay. 3D settings. Uh... What? Soft rasterizer or OpenGL. Okay. Uh, let's use OpenGL 3.2. Nope. Uh, OpenGL old. Will it work if I go into a menu and get an exit? No, it doesn't. What the fuck happened to my screen? Uh, enable TXT hack anti-aliasing. And let's go with this. Okay, I went into a battle, so this should fix itself. Okay, it fixed itself. There's a Poojiana here. Everything here is so far has been garbage. <laughs> I love this thing. I love it. Alright, here we go. I think I might need to reset the thing off screen. But who knows? Uh veil of water. Okay. Uh okay, so that was neutral. Let's try it higher head. Still neutral. So I don't know what you are. But it's fine. Oh my god, it's still a black screen. Okay, apparently I just reset the game when this happens. Uh, so when the screen goes black, you just hit save. And then you load it. Okay. Um, we're just gonna make this like a half hour of power, I guess. Okay. Uh, okay. We're just gonna open. We're just gonna open it again. Why not? This is going to get really annoying, but whatever. I think maybe the fact that I put in those plugins might help. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I was walking into some trees. Oh, hey, the tearing glitch fixed itself. Okay, the tearing fixed itself. That's nice. Okay, uh, I think I went the wrong way. None of these people battle, so whatever. Uh, okay, the Pokédex, they haven't given me the Pokédex yet. Okay, another encounter, what can we get? Bidoof again. So I think that replaces, like, um, Sentret and, uh, Hoot Hoot. So, what the heck, man? Actually, I should take the free experience because, uh, you can hit him on hit. Actually, this is a route up ahead, so what can we find in here? Let's see, I'm, I'm curious, I'm curious. Oh, I want to get the running shoes so bad, I want the running shoes. Alright, Route 46, what can we get here? Okay, here we go. 
we got Mime Jr. Nothing I've gotten is good. Nothing. I've seen nothing good. Bjorn is the only thing really that hype. Okay, then. Alright, neutral with Iron Head. Does not kill. Psybeam. And it's neutral on Psybeam, so what the hell? I think Bjorn might just be God Mode in this ROM. I could legit do a solo run with this thing, I swear to god. Like, he might just be that broken. Okay, here we go. Another encounter. Let's see what we can get. Weedle. Now, the thing is, all these things look like crap, but they'll evolve relatively quickly. So, honestly, I shouldn't feel that bad. Alright, neutral with Psybeam, and it's a one shot. One shot crit. Alright, good job, Bijorn. You got yourself a level. I don't see him learning that many moves, but the moveset that um, Bijorn is rocking right now, like, once he gets, like, a wing attack or something, like, or aerial ace, you know, I'll be, it'll be, it'll, we'll be popping, you know. Alright, so now we're in Cherry Grove. Oh, does this guy give you, I think this guy gives you the running shoes, actually. Yes, 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 yes. There. The guys on this forum also told me that, uh, you should save, like, all the fucking time. But, you know, whatever. You are wearing the running shoes, so go let's try, so try keeping them. There's your Pokemon Center. I don't care. There's a Pokemon. I don't care. In the modern games, they don't even like Pokemarts anymore. There are 30 this way. I don't even have to You have to go over here to continue the game, but you know, whatever. There's water. You can't go out with water yet. <sighs> Here's my house. Here's my house. There's still one. Oh. oh. Okay. Alright. Thanks for the new shoes. And now. You know what's funny? Like, okay. Yeah, click this button. <laughs> Otherwise, you gotta do the whole B thing. Alright. So I think that's a good place to end it off here. We got our starter, and uh, some funkiness happened. Which, you know what? There's always some funkiness. But, you know what? I'm gonna keep playing the game anyway, so who gives a shit? We might actually get our first encounter in the next episode, so whatever. Anyway. I'll see you all next time. Only you can prevent forest fires.